Okay, I'm getting ready to work on my punching bag. It's punching bag day. I have my clock. I have my wrist supports, which I need. And my water bottle, which I'm going to drink right now. So stay tuned. Of course, I have my punching bag too. <laughs> my $5 punching bag that it's uh, like nine bucks now or something. At tmu.com <laughs> the thing is good enough you know i need wrist supports because i did a headstand on my yoga trapeze and pulled my arms out and um, i was refusing to go backwards <laughs> i forced my body to go forward um yesterday i'm gonna have to fix that i gave you the wrong name of pants i had on uh, marika marika pants workout pants very very comfortable these are gallium's these are um, a little bit tighter, but they give you more of a tummy support, which I really need. Um, so if you're looking for that, really comfortable in the legs. So this is just a Nike or Reebok top. What emblem do we have on here? I believe it's Nike or Reebok. <laughs> I'll check that out too. So um, I have my timer because um, I try not to go over 10 or 15 minutes because it's a lot of my arms, but... Um, have a lot of swelling from abuse and so I have this separation kind of between my elbow and my upper arm and lower arm and I was losing um, circulation and then I have cognitive deficits from um, injuries throughout the year so punching has really helped me uh, get the flow probably emotionally a lot to being banged around but it has helped me get the, the flow going in my arms. Um, I don't hurt as much. I used to hurt so bad, the elbows of them, when I would sit down, the bone would hit the chair. It was very uncomfortable. And you know, I was getting you know uh, swallowed up by the cognitive deficits in the moment. And of course you're in tears and you're helpless and you're thinking there's nothing you can do. So um, yeah, I uh, was inspired by A Iranian middleweight champion boxer and uh, so I decided I wanted to box my way through. He was supporting women and um, I will put his name down here. <laughs> I always get it wrong. But um, when I saw this woman she started out with like no confidence and she ended up just whooping you know, like fighting with him though you know and I'm not necessarily looking to fight with someone. I just want to get my body to the best place it can be health-wise. So let's get this started. I have to warm up a little bit, though, too. Usually what I'll do is I'll row before I do it. But I just got back from a, a beauty appointment. Ah, there's my thing. Whatever that is, this is what it is. <laughs> but um, so I'm going to have to uh, definitely stretch the arms up. Yeah, I'm not saying I've never gone right into it, but I tell you, I woke up or I've been laying in bed when I go to bed at night, and it is painful when you haven't stretched out. Well, no, it's painful, period, when you're starting, but uh, I'm assuming it's worse when you haven't stretched out. So let's uh, let's get a few warm-ups in here, and if you have the shadow box, I'm horrible at shadow boxing. I'll try to do a few before I start on here, but I actually, uh, probably with my um, deficits, really need to see something to hit it. So shadow boxing, my arms just don't go at it hardly at all because it's like, you know, what are you trying to hit at? <laughs> so a little bit on my legs, I'm on the kitchen floor because you can see better out here, I feel. Um, and uh, at least for exercising, to show you. Just, I don't do a whole lot. Um, people do squats. I try to be careful. I have um, mild hemiparesis on the right side from my anesthesia incident anesthesia 1990 so I have to take all that into consideration so a lot of people do squats okay I can't go down real far I, I really do pretty good for you know everything going on with me so um these feel really good actually so I'll do a few more of these and my body's crying for water hitting the punch bag, I'm going to turn my time around so I can watch. So this will be kind of, um, it's the fun part when I start hitting the box, hitting the box, hitting the box, hitting the bag, hitting the bag. <laughs> 
hitting that bag. And now, of course, you know, it comes back slower. It's not really a, you got to give it time to come back to you. But, you know, I'm getting the same action in my arms. And uh, let me see if I can do it like you. Let me put the timer on. Oh, I'm already uh, losing a little bit of breath here, so that's good. You have to start you over. Um, that's weird. Oh, oh, I see what I did. I need to um, clear it in my head start. Okay, got the timer on. All right, let's do this. Pull this bag out here. And I think I'm gonna move you a little further back. I think that'll do it. You're supposed to just hit about 98% in your left arm. I'm assuming it's, I don't know, the same if you're righty or lefty. And um, I mean, I'm not an extra, of course. <laughs> hey, you got me. And then, um, you know, the full force, I just use like the, this part down in this arm. And of course, I don't have to hit it hard because it's just a light punching bag. And but I can feel the traction of the muscle being worked on. And uh, I'll just start out like, you do have to go back and forth in your feet. You're going to hurt your hips. So, oh, I just love that thing though, where I already have to start breathing, you know, a little heavier. It feels good. My body said, oh, we like this. I noticed lately when I'm exhausted, when I pull past that point, my body thanks me. Now, I'm not good at this at all, the underhooks, whoops, the underhooks, you're supposed to, I'm really bad at it. Oh, I said I was going to practice with the shadow box a little bit. Okay, now, if I do, like, I mean, I look ridiculous. Okay, that, that's my shadow box. <laughs> I actually need structure to be able to hit because I need it to help me. <laughs> and this thing comes back. Then I like to do my legs a little bit. Which I think is cool. I've got a little kid box. That's really weird. The bosses use that now, though. And I thought, hey, this is kind of fun. I mean, you know, my son was a yellow belt in karate when he was 10. You know, we got him through it and he loved it. And then he was nervous. And I know you got to finish what you started. And, you know, I started lifting my legs up and swinging them around, watching him and the kids, you know, my photos and memory. And um, so, you know, that always kind of stayed with me. I think I took one karate class and when I lived in Queens, New York, um, of course I'll start something like that and then leave. <laughs> oh, you couldn't see me. Let's move this up. There we go. There we go. I think that's pretty cool. To be able to do that. <laughs> oh, my bank is rock. We have no woman here. <laughs> Whoa, how dare you? Moving is very helpful. Now we're gonna drink. My body like so wants to do it again. Let me just get a little bit more of this stuff. Oh. oh my gosh. Okay, feeling it. Excuse me, I'm gonna get that water in there. If I would hear it all over there. We're sneakers, by the way. I like sneakers on. <laughs> I should have my sneakers on.
only know the three. Okay, we're on three minute sessions today. <laughs> okay, poof. I'll probably just do one more. Boy, what up? Very good warm up for me for my day. Um, I'm feeling happy. I'm feeling that serotonin go through my body. Um, I'm a happy camper, okay? I don't feel defenseless. I don't feel like a victim. Um, I'm taking control of my life. Uh, my body, my body's saying, you are strong, girl. You are strong. <laughs> and now legally, what could we do? I always wondered about that. What could I really get away with if someone really came after and hit me? Can I hit them? I've never hit anyone in my life, so. Oh no, I punched one guy in the mouth at a club. He tried to, I didn't even know when I was walking by. He literally tried to drag my body. And now that I know what all this bad stuff is that goes on, I mean, I took my fist and just went boom. I was in my 20s, so I, I think it was my mind, not my body, that did it. But anyway, that was the only time. And, uh, whew. but, you know, you think of something that someone you know or someone that's around or that, that doing it to you, like, can you punch them? watching guys. Hope I could teach you something. Lori Jean. Vanilla Women's Station Channel. <laughs>